was uh, that was unbelievable. Thank you. Thank you. I was looking at your face, and you looked very moved. Yes. A yes. few times I saw it look like that. Right, and and Mary Elena, I'm sure. Oh well, yes, maybe a Mary Elena when she saw or heard something that moved her. Yes. You're, mm. you're still in love with her. No, I'm not. I'm not. Mm, that confirms it. No, she always be a part of me, and she's an important person in my life. But for the two of us, something was not working. What element? We never found out. You, you said you were looking at my face. Why? Why were you looking at mine? Was I? You probably saw my tears. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm a little out of control. I was looking at your face because I find it very beautiful. You do? Of course I do. Of course I do. And you know I do. On the trip home, Vicky, who had mentioned nothing to Christina, was silent. Christina, on the other hand, talked nervously. I must apologize to both of you for, for ruining the whole weekend. I'm completely mortified. I'm humiliated. I, I don't know whether it was the wine. It could have been the shellfish because, of, you know, I have this ulcer. And I, I just thank God you knew enough sights to keep Vicky occupied. You know, I have these horrible nightmares that you two would be like oil and water, hating every minute of being together. I, I just couldn't move. Vicky buried herself in work at the library. She put foolish ideas out of her head and concentrated on her thesis, but she found her thoughts frequently returning to Oviedo. Christina, searching for a means of self-expression, wandered the streets of Barcelona, experimented with her latest passion, photography, and believed that she had made a fool of herself exactly at the moment of truth with Juan Antonio. And then, 48 hours later, Christina came to Vicky with an announcement. Vicky, he called. Hmm? What? Who? Juan Antonio, he called me just now. Juan Antonio called you? Yeah, he wants to see me, take me to some vineyard, some wine tasting or something. I said, absolutely. A, a wine tasting? But what about your ulcer? Oh, no, no, it's fine. A little wine's not going to hurt me. I mean, the point is that he wants to see me. Isn't that great? Yeah, yeah. I can't believe it. I never thought he was going to call. It's great. I'm happy for you. 